What is up YouTube? Welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be doing something a little different because I wanted to add a new dimension to this channel. I'm going to start with a little recurring segment I like to call Wet Read. Wet Read is where we discuss current events in radiology and interventional radiology. And I hopefully plan on doing it like weekly or monthly or whenever I get around to it or whenever something interesting is in the news. So hopefully you guys like it. Let me know what you think in the comments below if I should continue this or if it's terrible, I'll stop it. And we may need a new intro, so let's get to it. So our first topic for today is actually about the American Board of Radiology core exam, which if you've seen in my last video, is the exam I talked about in length, and I actually passed, which is awesome. But after the American Board of Radiology released the scores earlier this week, people weren't too happy about it because the fail rates have continued to rise over the last few years. The fail rate for this current examination that I just took was almost 16%, it was 15.9%. So that means only 84% of radiology residents passed the examination. That compares to the last year, which was a 13% fail rate, and the year before that, which was a 6.3% fail rate. So we go from the pass rate in 2017 being 93.5% to 86.2% in 2018, and now only 84% in 2019. So what does it mean that we have an increased percentage of radiology residents who failed year after year? I don't really know, to be honest with you. I don't think we're becoming less intelligent as the years progress. I don't think the American Board of Radiology core examination is getting harder. I think it's probably the same difficulty level year after year. But maybe one theory I have is that question writers are looking at our resources that we study off of and finding gaps in those resources and kind of hitting questions on those subjects. But honestly, I thought the examination was pretty fair. I did study quite a bit, so that may have helped, but I mean, anecdotally, I think it's a fair examination, but I don't think that, you know, 16% of radiology residents should fail the examination. I don't, I think it's something to look at, but I, you know, I don't know why that many people are failing. And in radiology, we have pretty high standards for radiology resident uh, applications. So we, the board scores for step one per se for radiology residents is generally pretty high on average. So I think most people who are accepted into radiology are pretty good test takers to begin with. So I don't think they become worse test takers as I go through residency, but I don't know, it's something to look at. It's very interesting. I'd be curious to see what the pass rates are for other specialties. So that is it for this episode. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I'll try to spend more time finding interesting topics for the next Wet Read episode. Make sure you follow me on Instagram, smash that like and subscribe button, turn on post notifications, and I will see you guys on the next video. Peace.